Lockwood, and thank you, Mr. Chairman. It is my pleasure to introduce my friend, uh, our uh, Agriculture Commissioner, Mr. Kent Leonhardt. Uh, he was elected in 2016 as our commissioner, and before that, he was in the West Virginia State Senate, representing my hometown of Glendale, West Virginia. But throughout his uh, tenure, Commissioner Leonhardt has really been an advocate for West Virginia farmers and the mission of the department. They've endeavored to break down silos to improve government efficiency, as we all know that's not the easiest thing, and are working to update regulations to move our West Virginia agriculture industry forward. So I thank him for that. In addition to being a farmer himself, he is also a veteran. He served 20 years in the United States Marine Corps before retiring with the rank of Lieutenant Colonel. I thought it would be interesting to point out to the committee that together uh, Commissioner Leonard and I have worked on a project of agritherapy, uh, a pilot program at the Woody Williams VA Medical Center in Huntington, West Virginia. This program will helpfully serve as a model to meet the mental and behavioral uh, health care needs of our veterans as well as provide them with a new career, new career opportunities in agriculture. Um, but I want to thank Commissioner Leonhardt's uh, commitment to breaking down barriers, but also uh, how we can better prevent the spread of chronic disease, uh, wasting disease within the wild and agricultural deer population. I'm proud to say that West Virginia is ahead of the curve in this regard, thanks to the Commissioner's efforts. Um, while we still have much work to do, I'm sure that we, uh, with his experience, we will be able to move the ball forward. I thank him for coming today, and I look forward to the panel. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Well, thank